it's my pleasure to introduce the minority leader of the state senate, Senator John McKinney. Now, first of all, let, let me say, get something right out in the open. I'm from Fairfield, Representative Fawcett, from Fairfield, Representative Wong, Representative Kupchik. Tara Cook Lippman belongs to us. She's ours. And we're not letting her go. Because she is awesome. You know, th this is one of the more remarkable bills that I've worked on over 15 years. You look at the list of co-sponsors, and there is no distinction between Democrat or Republican, whether you're from urban areas or suburban or rural areas. It doesn't matter. This is about becoming educated. When you understand, as we were talking about a couple seconds ago, that you can buy this weed killer called Roundup at a Home Depot, and there's just... All right, well, I can't scream as loud as he did, but... <laughs> When you, I was saying that when you buy a bottle of Roundup to kill weeds at Home Depot and you read the warning label on it and understand that's actually getting in our food system, you know something is going wrong. When you understand that in Europe they can sell the same products that they manufacture and sell here in America, but in Europe there aren't GMOs and in America there are, you understand that something is going wrong. One of the basic obligations of government is to protect its people. And that goes beyond just fire and police officers. That means public safety and protecting what you're eating. And we're not banning anything. We're not restricting anything. We're not taxing anything. We're just saying, let moms and dads know what's in the food they're buying for their young kids. These are who this bill is about. These young kids and the rights of their parents to know what's in the food products that they're buying. That's not a lot to ask. Label it. Label it. There we go. And that's what we're going to do. And, and that's what we're going to do in the state senate today on a bipartisan basis. We are going to be at the forefront in this. We're going to make Washington wake up and look at doing this nationally because that's the right thing to do. But, but here's my last comment. Don't waste any time today or tomorrow thanking the senators who voted for this. Spend all of your time talking to the members of the House from both parties who support it and demand a vote on the GMO labeling bill in the House of Representatives before we adjourn in June. Yeah.